recording. Welcome back. If you're new here, I'm Katrina Nicole. I talk about fashion, living my best life as a plus size babe. I do vlogs, I do style hauls and all kinds of different things. So if you're new here, welcome. I'm so happy that you're here on my little slice of YouTube. Today, I am doing another collective haul and the theme, the category for this collective haul is thirst trap. I am looking for sexy pieces that make me feel like a snickety snack or a thirst trap when I go out to the club. I have not gone out <laughs> in a really, really long time and I've realized that my closet is lacking all of those sexy dresses and pieces that I used to wear when I would go out pre-pandemic. So I really have not shopped this category very often in the last few years and I kind of had a difficult time finding pieces that I thought would work for me. So today's collective haul is going to feature pieces from Princess Polly, Nasty Gal, which I really love Nasty Gal. I did a full haul on Nasty Gal before and then I bought a few pieces from Skims as well. So let's get into this haul. Up first, Nasty Gal. Ah, I was so excited about this. This is a like bustier kind of style corset. Sexy, look at this. <laughs> I love this. Hopefully this looks as corsetty on. It does have a little bit of ribbing in like the bodice area, but it doesn't have any in the chest and I'm hoping that this looks cute on. So let's try this on. Immediately, yes, this is so sexy. <laughs> the fit is perfection, you all. Like. It literally makes the girls look amazing. The bodice is just so gorgeous. I love every single thing about this. I love the vibrancy of the color. Like, I definitely am feeling like a thirst trap in this top. Like, oh, it's so cute. I just think it's so effing sexy though. It literally hugs and curves every inch of my top so well. I feel super secure. The straps don't feel like they're gonna fall down. Everything is just, so good, this is pure perfection. I love it, I love it. <laughs> Obviously, this one is 100% a keeper. I am so in love with it. Let's move on to the second piece from Nasty Gal. Bonded corset is what it's called, and it's in black, it's a strappy one. I don't think it's the exact same material or style as this one. It's a little bit different, yeah, it's much different. This one doesn't feel quite as high quality as the other one that I, as the orange one that I'm wearing. This is in a size 2022. 20, it has some ribbing detailing right on the front of the chest and then it has that scoop at the bottom. So let's see how this one works. I love black, which is why I chose this, but I will say right off the bat, this is much more luxurious. The orange one is a very silky, sexy slip style feel. This almost feels more like nylon or rayon. It's not as sexy feeling as the oranges, but let's give it a try. Unfortunately, this does not fit at all. It's too small, which is so surprising. This was in the largest size in their 2022. Honestly, the fabric isn't that great anyways, and I love the orange one so much, and I do have quite a few pieces in black already. I'm not super bummed about it, but I was hoping that it would work. Mm. This one's gonna be returned, because it does not close <laughs> at all. all. Right, moving on to the last piece from Nasty Gal. This is a really beautiful dress. I loved the way it looked. It's kind of vibrant in color and it has like a slight tie-dye moment to it. Let's see, does this look like it's gonna fit me? I think yes. It's again got that really cute scoop neckline and it's just a really fun, pretty like sky blue with some rust in it as well. And I just think it's gonna be gorgeous on. So let me go put this bad boy on. If there ever were a dress to make me feel like a thirst trap, it would be this one. <laughs> Another banger. <laughs> Another freaking banger. This one is perfection. I absolutely love how it fits me. I love the whole short dress, you know, mini dress moment, but it is very, very hard for me to find one that's long enough to cover the peaches in the back and that hits at that perfect 
length in my thigh and this one absolutely hit the nail oh my god it is so good the entire dress just literally hugs and curves me so well i love this scoop line that it's got in the front it does have a little tiny bit of extra space in the top part of the bodice but i'm okay with that it's really comfortable it's so incredibly flattering i love the color i love the pattern and it's got me feeling like a snickety snack, y'all. <laughs> I'm in love. <laughs> I love it. Up next, Princess Polly. So they had a pair of sunglasses on their website that literally looked just like the infamous dupe. Where is, who wore those sunglasses? Pete Davidson? R.I.P. Pete Davidson. I can't believe Kimmy K already dropped you. Anyways, these are the infamous Prada sunglasses. They're the dupe. They're pretty damn close and they're actually really cute. I have a wider face. They fit my frame really well. Let's go with another dress. This is called the Eilish Mini Blue Dress. And it's like a curve kind of style. We'll see what we think of this. This doesn't feel super thirst trappy. It feels a little bit itchy. I don't love the quality, but let's give it a try anyways. 100% no, it's not long enough. Literally looks like I'm wearing a tunic. It has a really strange smell. The quality is not there. I just, I don't love it. I'm not into this at all. This is probably my least favorite thing that I've tried on so far. And that's including the piece that did not fit. That's how much I do not like this. So I really have a thing for like this blue shade, different shades of blue, 50 shades of blue. Yeah, I have a thing for 50 shades of blue right now. And <laughs> this is another like C kind of teal color dress. It's another body con style. It's called Holloway Wishes Mini Dress. I don't even remember ordering this. It's got a really sexy cutout in the back. Yeah, this is ruching material is so, so much better. I think I'm gonna like this one. <laughs> we like her, y'all. We like her. This is a, such a cute body con dress. I feel so sexy in it. It just makes me wanna go out and dance the night away. <laughs> It's beautiful, literally fits me like a glove. And it actually, the material just makes me feel so much more hourglass shaped. And I think that the ruching on the side of the dress also kind of gives you more of an hourglass, va va boom, sexy style as well. And I love how it actually accentuates my peaches in the back because of the cutout at the top of the dress, which is just the perfect little amount of peak Boo, right there. I 100% will be wearing this. Another dress. This is in my other favorite color, which is green. And this is more of an olive style green. I'm really hoping that this fits because it is a satin style material. It's a longer dress. It very much so gives me the vibes of what I would buy from Anthropology, except it's a little bit more cost friendly. Right off the bat, I can tell you, I do think this is gonna fit. It's a different neckline than I was actually expecting. It's a halter neckline. So it's gonna have that scoop and then the halter up at the top. And it has, again, a really deep cutout on the back. I don't know how I'm gonna wear this. I don't think I can wear a bra with this because of the way that this is designed. So we're gonna give it a try and see if this is gonna work for me. This works so well, actually. I was super surprised. I love the color. I actually love how the back looks. I think you can probably see it in my mirror. I just kind of tucked it into my bra and it looks really beautiful, especially with like the hair kind of cascading over it. I really actually like this. This is more of like a, like a sexy snack who is looking to be elegant, but sexy at the same time. Like this is when you're going on, you know, a date with a baller kind of dress. I actually really, really love this. It's, it's just, it works. It needs to be steamed like no other. It has a really, really high slit on the side. And I'm just so surprised that it fits me so well. I love the color. I love the way it fits. I love the way it looks everywhere. And it's just so beautiful. So I actually think I'm gonna be keeping this one as well. Okay, moving on to the next piece, which is a, it's called the Sound Check Maxi Skirt. And it's in like C color palette again. I really, really love this online. It actually came as a set, but the top was sold out. And I'm hoping that I love it just as much in person. It's a really beautiful material. It feels like the same material as the previous dress. And let's see. Oh, I love the pattern already. I can tell you that much. 
It's just really pretty. It just reminds me of the ocean. It just seems like a simple statement and we're gonna give it a try. I think I would probably wear this with just like a very simple black cami to go with it. So let's try this on. And our last piece from Princess Polly is called the Daydreaming Top. Oh, it's different than what I was expecting. It's another bodice style top. It's a corset in the front. It's really interesting. I don't know if I love this. It does look like it's gonna fit, but the pattern and the material is very different. It's definitely outside of my comfort zone, but it could potentially be cute. And initially, I think when I purchased this, I thought I would wanna wear it with the skirt, but I don't think the two go together. So I don't know exactly what I would wear with on the bottom, maybe full leather pants. I don't know, we'll have to see. So let's try this on. So this is surprisingly really good as well. It's so different than what I would typically wear and I think it's super unique. I don't know if I would necessarily with it, wear it with the pants that I chose to. I do think it looks cute with these, um, but I probably would style it with jeans instead and I think I would like that a little bit more better. It's really fun, it's <laughs> sexy and it fits really well, it's super comfortable, it's very breathable, and I like how it accentuates my waist and that it kind of gives me a little more of like a shoulder moment too because I don't have super defined shoulders. And yeah, I like it. <laughs> really, truthfully, I'm super excited about both Princess Polly and Nasty Gal because there was only one piece from each brand that did not work for me, which is such a surprise. So sexy. It's kind of giving me a little bit of like sexy Cinderella, um, but I do think I'm gonna keep it because it's it's so different than anything I own. Last but not least is this really fun mesh top from Skims. And I just recently got this. I haven't even taken the tags off yet. I purchased this in a size 4X and it's called the Fire Pal print, I think, or something along those lines. They had a dress in this material, but it's already sold out. And I really, really wish it wasn't because it's so good and it's so sexy. It is see-through and I love how it looks on. It gives me like futuristic alien vibes. <laughs> and I don't know, I'm kind of here for it. So I really, really love this and I just think it is so sexy. And it's like a little sultry alien snack. You know what I mean? Like there's levels to the sexiness, right? In terms of what we choose to wear. So I really, really love this piece. All right, everybody, that is it for this haul. I hope you all enjoyed going on this snickety snack, looking like a five course meal, thirst trap haul. <laughs> I had so much fun. I really loved like 90% of these pieces. Most of them are all actually pretty affordable too. I will link everything in the description box for you all. So if you wanna shop and you wanna look like a snack yourself, you can find it in the description. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.